Now, with the Chinese stock market tumbling over 30% over the last month or so, questions are rising about whether President Xi Jinping's so-called China dream of building a rich and powerful nation is merely that, nothing more than an unachievable dream. Shin Semin reports. China's key economic indicators show that the world's second largest economy is slowing down. Industrial output has been dropping, and China's central bank has slashed its benchmark rate four times since last November. While China has been showing signs of a stock market rally, analysts say that the drastic collapse of equity prices and the recent stock market debacle suggests that the bubble may have burst. Experts say that the country's experiences in the past few weeks will not prompt the government to take too many risks in terms of financial reforms, as the fervent policies already in place may have helped inflate the market in the first place. The, 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 the pace as compared to what we saw in the past two years will slow down because the government needs breathing space to go back to the drawing board and, and think about you know, what went wrong in the implementation process. But one investor says the market's recent fluctuations were normal. For a Chinese market, it's normal. China's market is different from developed markets overseas because there are too many speculators in our market. China's key share indexes fell following a three-day rally. The Shanghai Composite had fallen over 1 percent at the end of trading on Tuesday, while the SCSE component index gained 0.9 percent. Xin Zemin, Arirang News.